Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, thank you so much for tuning in. If you saw yesterday's video, you'll know that I was at a wedding. Um, I'm back now, obviously. Um, I actually feel okay. I'm a little bit warm because it's like a million degrees outside, but um, yeah, feeling okay. I had breakfast at the, um, at the wedding, which I think was in yesterday's video, but um, I will just show you a photo of it so you can have a look. Obviously, I don't know how many calories is in it. I kind of feel like um, this week is gonna be a gaining week. Um, either that or I need to do some serious damage control. So yeah, um, obviously, so I was at the hen party on Friday and then at the wedding yesterday, which I haven't tracked calories for. I mean, I did like breakfast and lunch, even and I've got no idea, so um, yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna go and meet um, Robin and Emma, my friends down at the allotment, go and have a little chill out there, and I think we're gonna go for a walk. So I'll just see you there. Right, I'm at the allotment now. I'm just gonna give you a quick update on um, how things are going. So these are definitely ready and we've picked some. So I think I'm gonna be taking some of these home. The leeks are starting to stand up, which is a good sign. Um, I don't know when these are ready though. I think they look kinda ready. Um, so I can pick some of them out. We've also planted the sweet corn here, which is uh, looking good. We've got some pea pods in the back over there. Um, and these are potatoes. We've also got some melons here and we've, also, and we've been given a red bell pepper plant. So I'm looking forward to that doing something. Um, we do have some more sweet corn there, but I don't really know where we're gonna put it because um, we don't really have the space for it at the minute. But yeah, so our cucumbers are doing well. Let's have a look. Got some cucumbers growing in there. Um, the tomatoes. This one, this one's getting some nice tomatoes on it. Yeah, and that's what they look like. Way. <laughs> Right, so it's now tea time and I'm just gonna be making, obviously, some tea. Um, I thought I could make something with the shallots that I brought back from the allotment. So I've just popped out to Tesco's and picked some things up. Um, this recipe is something that my mum's had, so um, it's basically pork, pork and apple with shallots. Um, so I'll just show you what ingredients I'm using for that. So this is what I've got. I picked up a um, pork shoulder joint. Um, which I'm just going to be popping in the oven. I've got three leeks there, but I'm only going to be using one of them. Um, I'm just going to be using an apple. I've got some butter as well. Um, I've got some apple cider, which um, is on the recipe. I'm not 100% sure what this does, but you know. Um, and then I've just got some very lazy chopped garlic. And then, of course, the shallots. So basically, I'm going to be popping this in the oven. This goes in for quite a while, um, but I need to, like, score it and um, put some things on it. I think I'm just going to be popping the garlic on top along with some salt and popping that in the oven, I think, for maybe about an hour to start with, just to see how it goes. Uh, so you basically, you brown off the apple and the shallots in a pan with the butter um, and then add them into the roasting tin and um, pop it in. I don't actually have a roasting tin, so it'll have to be... This will have to do, so yeah. So I'm just gonna start with that.
So this is the pork now out. How amazing does that look? So the shallots and apples have just been um, stewing there in the juices. And let's just give this a listen. Oh, how good's that? Anyway, um, so I'm just gonna slice this up. Obviously, this is more than one portion. Um, so I'm just gonna be uh, serving up a portion of this and then I'll be leaving the rest for another day. So basically what I need to do with this next is I need to remove the um, the pork and the apple and shallots and leeks out of there and keep, but I need to keep the juices because I'm then going to pop it in a saucepan with the cider and um, heat that through and, until it thickens and makes a sauce. there is my tea so I um for the crackling I have chosen to not have very much fat with it I just just the fatty part of the pork there just isn't really for me so I've just left that out um in regards to calories so the recipe that my mum sent me said that it was 450 calories per serving however I've kind of made this like a little bit wrong because essentially the the whole recipe serves eight so I've cooked a f obviously a full a full pork joint. Um, the apple and the shallot I just kind of rus roughly guessed for one portion, and then the um, and then the gravy I've just like made that for eight people as well, and so I've got loads of that left over. But I will, but I will use this another day. Um, so yeah, so I'm gonna go and eat this. Roughly 450 calories. Not 100% sure on that though. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go and I'm gonna go and eat that and then this will be portioned up for another time So it's now about half past ten. I've been watching Love Island um, because I missed the um, The first one yesterday because I was at the wedding um, Yeah, so I thought I'd kind of summarize not just today, but the last couple of days. Um, basically, I am unsure on my calories for today because the breakfast, um, I don't know how many was in that. Um, I didn't actually have lunch, which, like, that's not like me. Of course I have lunch, but, like, no, I, I didn't have lunch today for some reason. Um, and then the pork and apple with shallots, I think was around 450 calories, unsure though. Um, so I, I'm not 100% sure on the calories. I also haven't been wearing my Apple Watch, which is probably the first time in God only knows how long. Um, I haven't worn it and um, basically, basically I took it, um, I was wearing it yesterday at the wedding. I forgot to take a charger, so when I stayed overnight it ran out of battery. Um, and yeah, I basically have just left it off today. Um, so I'm unsure on the steps. So, yeah. So obviously the last couple of days, um, obviously with the hem party on Friday, then uh, Saturday, Sunday, we're okay. Today, uh, Monday, obviously we had the wedding. Um, so I think now that is all of my kind of events done for now um so i kind of want to get back onto a streak of just eating my calories um getting my steps going to the gym no interruption for like events and things like that where i go like off track um so i'm gonna really start knuckling down now because like i just want to make a bit more progress really so yeah that's um that's what i'm gonna be doing so yeah so starting from tomorrow i am back on track officially no more no more excuses no more events we're gonna get it we're gonna do this so yeah anyway i'm gonna head up to bed now because i am quite tired um so i'm just gonna end the video there if you did enjoy it then please give it a thumbs up go hit the subscribe button below and if you want to be notified for when i do upload then you can hit the bell as well thank you so much for watching and i will see you tomorrow Bye.